everyone, my name is Lizzie Esparza and this is Ash GCU, the safest way you possibly can be remotely. So today we are reacting to uh, best advice for moving far away from home. Oh, hi, just came from downstairs. I'm Elliot and this is Ash GCU. <laughs> and I'm the new guy. <laughs> Well, and we have today, Andrew. we have our own new guy. Hey, Andrew. Which is me, Andrew Rangel, the one that likes to be able to do stuff. The more you know. Hello, everybody. My name is Thomas Pace. Abby. <laughs> Abby. <laughs> Today's question is, um, what is it? Today's question is, what is the best advice for moving far away from home? What do you do? I don't know. His hair. Him yesterday saying, I'm trying to grow a mullet. I've been trying to figure that out for a couple of years. No one told me. I wish I had this episode, but I didn't. So now you have it. <laughs> so yeah, let's go ask some people. Let's go. <laughs> Can we ask you a question? Sure. Where, where are you from? Where are you from? Where are you from? I, who, whoever edited this episode? Colorado. Seattle. Uh, Maui. Chicago. Oregon. Dallas. Hawaii. Boise, Idaho. Montana. This is so weird. This is a new experience for me. Carrying a microphone around. I have a question. What advice do you have for people that live far away from home? Get connected to your community. I would say make friends fast. Get plug in a community here. Go to as many things as you can. Community. 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 Thank you guys for community. Make a circle of friends, for sure. That's where you're going to have your, your own family in Phoenix, so do that. I love being on camera. <laughs> <laughs> We definitely can't put that in the episode. <laughs> I hope that they put in like really bad royalty free music. <laughs> Talk to mom a lot because you miss your family. FaceTime your mom every week. Every day. I call my mom every day. <laughs> just like take a breather and know that a lot of people are also from far from home and just like you're all in it together. Bring a fridge, I guess. I don't know. Or don't bring a fridge. <laughs> bring a fridge. I'm just thinking about how everybody's saying call your mom. And then I look at my FaceTime log, and it's just... Mom. Look at, those are all from two days. <laughs> Guys, I'm so sorry. Try and really take care of yourself. Like, make sure you're eating well and, like, exercising and stuff. Because it's super easy to just, like, not do that. Um, well, I try to, like, surround myself. Not even a word. <laughs> myself. <laughs> Buy things that, like, remind me of home. And, I don't know, bring, like, little mementos from home. That's what I did, and it helped a lot, yeah. That was so wholesome. She goes, bring mementos from home. <laughs> Single tear. <laughs> we need an emoji again. I, I guarantee you Sierra can do it. She can just like, boom, snap, zip, zap. It's done. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank you guys so much for watching. That's Abby. She's in the grass. She wanted to do the, in, the outro in the grass. Can you do the rest in the grass? But I didn't want to sit on the grass because it's probably wet. Okay, Abby. What did you learn today? I learned that you should call your mom and dad. What did I learn today? Uh, to establish a community, because that was like the number one answer that we got. And I'm not hating on anyone for giving that answer. Thank you for giving that answer. It's a good answer, honestly. It is. Elliot, do you have anything you want to say? Yes. Thank you so much, Elliot. We're good. That's it. Signing off. I think the episode was so nice. I feel like we have a lot of funny episodes, obviously. But mm -hmm. uh, that one was also really like comforting. Coming from a place where the, the weather and the climate and just everything is so different it can feel so hard being away from everything you've been used to so to have a, like a support system but then also knowing like you still have your family and friends back home as well I think is like comforting even though it can be hard. I was here for the first time I was kind of nervous because I didn't know anyone as I said before but now when I got used to the campus and then the students here everybody's pretty much friendly here and getting to be able to be part of GCU TV, it was an amazing experience now. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Today was awesome. Bye. Bye. Tweet hashtag AskGCU to get your question featured.